Hey everyone, this is a quick video to outline uh, adding Teams meeting events that you may have been invited to or shared with your team, how you can add that into your calendar. Um, so when someone schedules a meeting in Teams, um, they can do that in the calendar section here and you can go to new meeting and they could schedule something you know, for one person for you directly or they may schedule it for a team and in a certain channel. And you do that here under the add channel. That way it appears uh, in that channel for all the members, um, but depending on the team type, if it's a class team, it will be added to students calendars automatically, but with ones that are for PLGs, for staff, um, it's not automatically going to add that invitation to their uh, calendars unless they've been added here under the add required attendees. So if you see though that you've got uh, a team's meeting that's been scheduled in one of your teams, like uh, just happened here. So uh, Hillary's invited me to an ICT meeting. Um, you can just simply hover over that uh, event and you can click on ellipses and you'll have an option to view meeting details, even if you're not the organizer of the event. So you've got the link to join here. You can see who the organizer is there. Uh, but you've got this option at the top to add to calendar. So you just click on that and then you can confirm that you're accepting. You can send a message to the organizer. Uh, just, Thanks for organizing, Hillary. And that's it, you accept. And uh, now you'll see that on your Outlook calendar, which I'll bring mine up here in uh, just a moment to show you, on your Outlook calendar, you'll now have that event. So here, if I show you mine here, so there's the 3.30 meeting that uh, Hillary has scheduled in our team. And again, in that calendar uh, event as well, in Outlook, you'll have the option to join the link. Um, and as well, if you've got Teams open, even if you didn't add this in your calendar, if you've got the uh, Teams app, either the desktop app open, or you've got the mobile app on your device, when that meeting starts uh, next Tuesday at 3.30, you're going to get a push notification that a meeting's begun. Um, but this is just a nice way where you can add it into your calendar, and that way, again, it helps you kind of keep track of your workflow, uh, and you'll see that there. So that's it. Let me know if you have any questions.